Okay, no one complained this time. Let's, uh... Whoa! Floor number eight. So great! Hello? Yes, you're calling about the new night position. Yes, um, yeah, I'm glad you got my application. Uh, so, how was the success? Oh, really? Wait, so I start today? Wait, hang on. I never gave you my number. How did you call... Call me? What the hell? Oh, hey, guys, didn't see you there, but, you know, now that you're here, maybe we should do this job together, you know? What we're about to do is play a game by Chiller's Eye, a brand new one, in fact, called Night Security. So, what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome to Night Security. I said before, like, this is Chiller's Eye, brand new horror game, no idea what to expect, though the title of the game suggests we're probably doing security in that night time. Let's dive straight into this game, man. Here we go. All right, hang on. This is not the intro I expected. You know what? I'll go ahead and take this thing. All right, we're in a nice little house. Lighting looks good. We've got the AC running, keeping cool on these summer days. Dang, what the sounds bad out there? Are you hearing that? We've got the gramophone just there. Little kids play area, all kinds of things to look at. I mean, let's get going, guys. You enjoyed this episode? I think you know exactly what to do. Uh, we can take a seat. I see I've got food. I can't make out what that is in the bottom right. Maybe, uh empty tray of food of some kind. Look, I just finished wrapping up eating that meal. Let's go. I got, uh, I got a sink and, and a, a, a stove. I don't know why I'm acting like this is so amazing. Family picture here. Okay, we see no comments about who these are, just, uh, family members. Birthday cake! Hey, happy seventh birthday to someone, I suppose. Keep that chilled up. Dang, my kids are living that good life. So we're trying to film, like, a happy event, like a happy birthday thing. I like this. Very positive, uh, Start to this. So, where is my daughter or son? Where are they at? Hold up. Hey, you in here? You hiding out? We got dirty laundry. Oh, in that trash. That's nasty. <laughs> it's so nice right now, guys. There's nothing bad about this. Poop station, shining by the weight, glimmering in that room. So, what's the deal? Okay, is that my wife? I think it might be. Okay, we'll leave her sleeping. And here, we have my daughter. Has it been her birthday today? Okay, we just start filming her while she's sleeping. That's kind of weird, but also, um, maybe it's maybe it's fine. I don't know. So I guess that's uh, everything checked out. Maybe it wasn't her birthday today. It's coming up. We see 20 seconds. Let's just look at this. Oh, the next day. It is her birthday tomorrow. All right. Happy birthday. We see that scribble down there. It's all good, man. It's... Hello? What the freak is that sound, bro? Maybe it's time for bed, right? You know, prepare all of the uh, surprises for the morning. Check in here as well. I got a closet. Maybe I'm getting changed into my uh, nighttime garbs. It is time to sleep. I'm not sleeping in a suit, man. Close that door. Is it time for bed, though? I have no idea. Like, it might be morning. I don't know. Okay, something's going down. Uh, I think we're leaving. Maybe for work or something? It might be a very early morning. Wait, with the night guy, right? With the night security dude. This was my job. How did I forget? Gotta get to work, man. Gotta get to work. Pull the handbrake up. We here? We might just be. Very blistery night, man. It's cold. Ugh. Hope you got your umbrella, sir. October the 22nd, 22nd security, security guard. guard. 35. Yo, this game feels so far like much more polished than the other stuff. I like this uh, this intro. Want some of these goods from these machines, huh? Ah, I left my cash in the car and the rest of it all at home. Let's just survey the building as it is right now. Like, we got to see what's going on here, right? We are the security guard. Anyone trying to break in? Certainly don't look like it. The streets are extremely quiet at this hour. And I don't know why I would be surprised by that. It's the nighttime. That's what goes down in these places, bro. People, they do their things in the day most of the time. Let's go through the doors. Let's go ahead and see what's uh, hopping on through here. Hello? Hey! I mean, guys, it doesn't have to be weird. It don't have to be weird. Maybe someone else was here. The surveillance room is on the right. I should check my job. Um, you don't want to comment on the intruder? It's a bad start, guys. It's a bad start. And we're also pretty bad at our job if we didn't see that. How's it going? I'm on Bro, what the freak is going on back there? Okay, we got some cheers. That'd be quiet. Hold on, hold on. Oh. Oh, okay. Maybe I should try and, you know... Get rid of the sounds in the background. Dude, this is so weird. Let me check that time. The hands of the clock point to midnight. It's that night shift. I mean, surprise, surprise. We are doing that nighttime hour. All of these. Looks like some people are still here. Okay. 
For now, I should go around and lock the door, starting from the first floor. So this isn't an abnormality, seeing people here. I'm not sure what we're doing here. Check the fire alarms in the back of the rooms and lock the doors. Number two, turn off the lights in the bathrooms. If people are still present, send them home. What are they doing out there, man? Slamming doors? Hold up. Second note just here as well. I lost contact with Kigo Ochiri, who used to be a security guard for this building. He probably quit. I'm going to rely on you from now on. This company apparently has a rule prohibiting any overtime work past midnight. Check the clock, surveillance monitor, and security details before making your rounds. Best regards from manager Yamamoto. Wait, hold up. Let me just read that one more time. The company has a rule of prohibiting any overtime work past midnight. Dude, why'd I get here at midnight? We have a problem already. You know, guys? That's doesn't align up right. Just fixed up the textures, bro. This game looks much better already. I like the lighting. It's a good looking game, right? Hey, chillers, uh, you've started to really improve with the graphic stuff. So we do our rounds. Are we on the first floor at the moment? I don't know what that's seeing. Warning, some stuff like that. This, okay. Is this like uh, maybe an office space of some kind? Like uh, we got boardroom here, some notes scattered down there. You can see where the rain pelting on these windows, man. And we're quite high up by the looks of things. You see all that? Could have sworn I entered through that basin floor, but apparently not. Okay, let's uh, keep moving forward. It's just a normal night on the job. No reason to be paranoid about anything. Printer's doing their thing. Leave the elevator for now, because this is the first floor. This is all we got to do. Yep. Hey, how you doing, sir? Should we talk? I mean, it says send them home, right? Why are you still working? What are you doing? Oh, you're the new security guard. Is it time already? I guess I'll force the rest on my subordinates tomorrow. See ya. Take care, sir. Better you get home safe than you don't. What does that sound, guys? Are you not weirded out by this, sir? Oh, no, I've been hearing that all night. Are you sure? Like, I feel like this is weird, man. No, 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 you're just being paranoid. Shut the heck up, I'm going home. Sir, are you not hearing buckets fall over, though? Shut up, I'm going home. Stop talking to me. All right, gain some manners, by the way. Can I go out there? Let me go. Oh. Dude, it's a one-way system. Close that door for now. Okay, let's uh, make haste with these rounds anyway. I don't know what that is. Some kind of uh, alarm system. So all we're doing is making sure... Bro, I hate these sounds. I hate these sounds. I haven't finished patrolling yet, so we can't go through there. Keep checking these ones out, maybe. What's in here, though? Oh, wait, wait, wait. You can check in these. And then if we see people, then we send them home. Got it, got it, got it. Look at these paperwork stacked up, man. Very, very high. Okay, what's the deal with this one? They gotta tidy this room up. That's one thing. Definitely gonna be putting that one on the agenda. So we gotta go all the way down, which we already have. Uh, bathroom lights, right? It was uh, bathroom lights. We gotta check these things. Looks good. So light switch. Why do you put the light switch here, bro? Why does that reverb so loud? Hold on, hold on. I feel like at any moment, I'm just gonna look down here and around the corner of that wall, we're just gonna see... It's coming, man. It's gonna happen sooner or later. These bathroom stalls, they're gonna spring open. And the life is just gonna flourish in that place. Probably the dead kind of life, you know what I'm trying to say? Bathroom lights are off. This place, it got a bit more quiet, you know, guys? Let me just check my board again one more time. I'm new here, I'm trying to learn. Check the fire alarms in the back of the rooms. That's what we did not do. We missed those fire alarms. So, um, gotta keep on top of that one. I suppose this is gonna be it here. Yep, here we go. And we check this, no abnormality. So that one's good. We seal this room up and we check the same thing, perhaps in those other rooms too. And that's all we gotta do. Close that one, hold to lock. Just like so, it's a simple job. We're just gonna man this building, keep things safe, stop anyone breaking in, or discourage it at the very least. We gotta fix these pipes up. We gotta fix these pipes up, dude. It's not good. The amount of noise and whatever going down, like, is the... Bro, I can't stand this. Hold up, good. We can stand that though, no abnormality. I think I'm the only one scared in this situation so far. Like, there's probably nothing to actually be concerned about. I'm creating this narrative of a horror game in my head, and that's all it is. Not gonna look. Lock the door, look. Wait, it doesn't matter to me. It does not matter. It's all good. We've checked those doors as well. They're all locked up, so we'll close this. That's a nice little sound. All right, that must be a good jingle. We did our thing. We can now, can these... Bro, what, whatever that is, I don't know what's making that noise. I have no idea. Let's go back to our station. We did what we needed to do. Is this done first, by the way? Okay, it's not. How did the door close when I locked every door, by the way? Turn off the lights in the bathroom. Did we not already do that task? I feel like we did. We got the, the kind of chirpy sound to say like, yes, you did it. Looks like people are still here. Uh, for now, I should go around and lock the doors, starting from the first floor. So there must be maybe one or two more doors. Is it something to do with this here? Do I have to check any of these floors? I'm gonna back up. I don't know why. It said people are still in this building. Pull this down. 
They're gonna be in there? Like, do I head upstairs? All right, all right, it's quiet. There's no one here. I guess I go up a floor. I thought I was done, but apparently not. We just gotta keep that flow then for every single floor. There is 11 by the looks of things. Yep, all the way up to 11. Same routine. We have a baseline down now. We know what we do. That's all it is, man. Simple objective, floor 2F. So, we race this time, okay? The quicker we get this done, the quicker we can just relax in our office space without having to worry about a single thing. Ma'am, what are you staring at, huh? You're straight up like Blair witching me right now and I don't like it. What is it? Oh, are you perhaps... Hmm, you're cool. Let's exchange contact information. I can't leave unless you give me your contact information. I promise you won't regret it. She even said a love heart emoji somehow. <laughs> you better not ignore me. Goodbye. What the freak? Bro, I met this lady like four seconds. Dude, tell me your charm. How did you do that? How did you do that? All right, good. And he's just back at the job. Who calm and collective? Dude, this, this man has a gift. It's, uh, it's a good one. That's all I'm saying. Did you, did he tell her, though, that he had the wife and stuff? Like, you probably should have let the lady know. Um, I hope he didn't give her the contact information, unless, you know, you're kind of one of those people. Anyone in here? Hello? Looks like it's quiet on the front again in this room. So check the, uh, fire alarm, and that's it, right? It's good again. Like, two floors down. It's all good. Is it going to be this for a level four? I think the lady just fell over. Um, I think man might have broken her foot or her head. Something like that, guys. I don't know. It, ain't, it didn't sound good, though. So go in here. It's the same thing. All we do is this. Bro, I've done this job. Oh! What? What? What do you want? Oh, the security guard. Can you please leave the lights on? I'll turn them off. Okay. Can you make sure you do that? Because, uh, you know, place is actually closing up. There we go. I guess we leave that person in there. They promised they'd turn them off. I trust you in there. Don't let me down. I will get fired. Is that what they want, though? Like, is that what's happening here? Trying to get us in trouble. It better not be. It better not be. So, floor three, it's a uh, standard job. That's all we gotta do. Of these floors, how weird could it get, though? Is there some kind of weird undertone to this place that we're yet to figure out? You know, with a new night guard, that old one left. Presumably in quite a hurry, to the extent where they didn't even find him, right? It makes you question, like, why? Why would he leave? The job isn't hard. This building seems okay. Wait, the frick was in there. Hey, anyone in here, though? This is a bad spot for a fire alarm. It's kind of weird. Okay, that one's all good. It's so loud. I feel like we're getting closer to the source of the rattling. Anyone in this one? There's no one here. Are we hearing feet? Dude, it feels like there's someone literally on this floor with me. Okay, I am literally getting freaked out over nothing. I'm just gonna do the thing. Turn the lights off, let's go. Bop. Um, hey! Hey, who are you? Um. What on earth? What did they, I mean, they could have been in this bathroom. Wait, why did you turn the lights off? Didn't I ask you to? We're on a different floor, bro. Dude, I'm sorry. Turn the back on. Yo, we're on a different floor though. Wait, what the heck? Why is he on the same floor twice? Why is he pooping on two floors? Odd, sir. It's kind of weird. Not gonna lie. Let's lock these doors up. That VCR player makes me kind of feel like, do we want to explore what that is, you know? We probably should take a look at what might be on there. Let's take a look. It's a darkened room. Very darkened room. Here we go. Let's uh, examine the VCR tape. Why did someone leave this here? And what's on it? Ain't much, so... Typing away on a keyboard or something like that. Paperwork spinning. You better have these done by tomorrow. Okay. What are you looking at? Well, uh, conversation? I guess a normal conversation going down? That's like boss and the worker? Whoa! Wait. Okay, hang on, what's that all about though, man? That was weird, right? Little bit sussy. Odd find, very peculiar, not gonna lie, very strange. Anything over here? Did we check the, um, the system here as well? I think we may have. Okay, we didn't actually, so that was important. No abnormality again. All right, that's good, two for two. I guess it'd be three for three. Every single time it's, uh, worked out great. Is that not all of them done? I feel like it's all of them done. Hold up, hold up. Just this. There it is. That's... How are there two sets of doors like that, bro? I mean, I guess that's a safety feature. What on earth is going on? There's just something that doesn't sit right in the air at this place. It's just someone above me in the elevator. Bro, it's closing. I didn't choose my floor. 
Now I'm going to choose my floor, so it's like the demon may have closed the doors, yes, but no, I am still controlling the situation. So one more floor. This is floor number four. All right. Floor 4F. Every floor starts out the same. Like, it is the same layout every time. That's not weird. What's this? What's going on here? Um... Hang on, what's this? Is that like a female worker in this place? Um, I want to stop the machine. It's wasting lots of paper. Dude, th okay. This is the first floor that feels like, uh... Yeah, maybe you want to start checking your six a little bit more often. And what is this room here? Storage room? Go in? Oh, boy. Bro, I've just cornered myself. Hold up. It's all good. No worries. See? No problem. Check for workers. Oh, what is with this? Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. Let's just check the button and get out of here, right? Oh! No abnormality. However, something just broke. What was that? Was it in this room? Dude, I don't know. Nope. Ain't no chance. Wait, no way, boy. Yep. Just remember that room is uh, a weird one. It's like the higher up this place you get, the the more strange and bizarre things are starting to become. Checking this room here. Is there anyone in here? Sir, are you okay? In this dark situation. You know what? Let me check the fire thing, then I'll explain why I'm pointing a flashlight in your face. No abnormality. Okay, now let's talk. You shouldn't be here, buddy. It's you again. My boss wants me to finish this work by tomorrow morning. There's no way I can finish all of this. I never thought being a working adult would be this tough. They even told me to clock out on time. They got to be kidding me. You're the only one who knows how hard I work overtime every day. Seeing you boosts my mood because it means I can go home. So, I guess I'm going home. See you tomorrow. Dang, that's rough. It's like he stays here until he sees us and only then he realizes he can leave. Man, well, I'll have to start coming to The heck did you see that? We're gonna have to start coming to work earlier. Dude, he's got that shit. Look at his neck, man. That's that's a sussy neck. The way that thing moves, I'm following more <laughs> I'm following him all the way out, man. What the heck am I seeing? You uh you get out of here, alien. Oh, that was weird. That was weird, okay? I think we found the true horror for this floor. Just uh go ahead and do this. Yep. Great stuff. Huh. The fluorescent lights are flickering. I need to replace them. Oh, in the storage unit, right? Okay, no one complained this time. Let's, uh... Whoa! What's going on with this place, dude? What the heck is going on with this place? Do my job, get out of here. Do my job, get out of here. Do my job, get out of here. What was that? Dude, what the heck was that? Is that like the lady we saw being scanned multiple times? I haven't replaced the fluorescent lights yet, but you want to look at that thing. What are you doing, sir? Well, that was an eerie start. That was a very uh, eerie start. Okay, we've got what we need. Replace the bulb. Very odd placement, right? The one place we see that bizarre thing through the glass is exactly where the lady is. It's like there's a bit of a link there. Maybe her presence was causing that. You know what? I'm done with this floor. Our man is very determined and strong-willed. Like, nothing scares this guy. Freak? What was that? Hello? Bro, I think I went away from it. It's... I'm not sure if that's the... It might be the printer making that much noise. I don't know. Like, I don't even know what the heck's going on. Okay, floor five. Just, uh... Keep at this. This is a very interesting idea for a game. It looks really good as well. I like this one so far from Chillers Out. Like, they always do so many unique and different ideas for little indie horror game experiences. So I always respect that. So floor number five. This looks a bit more, I would say, unkept. Looks like we've got some kind of discoloration forming around the tops here. Uh, whoa. It's a little dark on this floor. Let's go check the electrical room. Okay. Which is where, though? We'll be down here. This floor is nice and shiny, at least. Okay, we got some light. Let's go. Let's go. All is good. The fuse is missing. Dude, I almost expected. And I still am. Bro, this don't feel right. Where would the fuse be? In here? Nah, bro. Nah, we can't do that. It's like this floor is dedicated to uh, electricals or something like that. Flip this. The level won't budge. Looks like Looks there's, like no, there's power. no power. Let's find Let's the, reason. the reason. We need a fuse, first of all. That's what we need. So we come here as safety measure number two. None of them are going to move. Okay, so that's the reoccurring theme here. At least, I think these are still working. We can... Yep, let's turn the lights on. All right, so it's all about that step, first of all. I want to get out of this room. I 
Definitely gotta get out. Huh? Huh? What do you mean it's locked? I am the one possessing the keys. I am the one who locks. It's messed up, dude. It's messed up. This door's gonna open. Okay, that's what I like to see. So maybe down the base in here, we've got that red light. Man, it's an ominous floor. It's a very ominous floor. You know what? Let's actually not open these doors just now. Still sealed up. What the heck is this? You know, now is the time we turn back and say, hey boss, what's wrong with this place, huh? What's wrong with this place? I think I found the reason why the night guard never came back. He's stuck on floor number five. Can we die here, dude? Can we die? Yo, what on earth is going on? Uh, this, okay, I'm actually nervous. They could be anywhere. They could be anything anywhere. What is this, dude? What does it all mean? Scaffolding, holding these walls up. Were they trying to repair this place at one point? Was it irreparable? They had to leave this floor to just succumb to, uh, whatever's even happening here. It's like a red liquid filling this hole. Placer, man. Got steel beams. It's basically like the skeletal structure of this building. Even just showing its corners, showing its colors, bro. Like, that's all it is. Okay, what is that? I don't need that. I need power. Has to be a fuse. Lying around somewhere. In one of these spaces. Though. Hey, just a fuse. I'm not asking for anything else. You know, just a fuse. I'll be out my way. I'll be happy. And uh, all that stuff, right? You don't have to be so bad. You don't have to kill me. I'm not here to harm you. So why are you here to harm me? They listened. But did they listen to the part about not harming me? Right, guys? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. You know, one recurring theme I've noticed about this place, other than the, the, the red floor, and the scary drone that uh, is probably warning me should have never came this far, is the idea of all these corners, and the fact that anything could just jump out at any given time and uh, do whatever it wants. Do they have a mace? You know, do they have uh, an axe? Do they have anything else that would do similar damage? I don't know. They haven't jumped out. You know what, guys? I've decided you can do the let's play from here on out. I'm, I'm not playing this no more. Enjoy the game. Go on, take a seat. Take a seat. I'll watch you play it, huh? It's always you watching me. It's your turn. Take a seat. Get those headphones on. Volume up max. Go on, let's do it. Yeah, I didn't think you'd step up. So scary bathroom lady is here. Scary bathroom lady is here. And so am I. Oh, wait, wait, hold up. You know what, that door? That door gets slammed shut. That door gets slammed shut. I don't like this. I don't like any of this. It's like she's following us up these floors. But why am I walking in water? Did you hear that? All right. Yep. He's attached. <laughs> I'm sorry, ma'am. It's just, it's very weird for someone to just stand up like that behind me. Do you understand how weird that is? Th there you are. The lights haven't turned on yet, so can you flip the four of the uh, circuit breakers? Uh, me? I'm leaving. Good luck with your job. So you just stand behind people. Like, I'm gonna do it to you. Yeah, it's not so normal now, is it? Where are you going? The door's that way. Ma'am, what the heck? Okay. All right, that's normal. To take an elevator is normal human behavior. This is all completely normal. I still think she's probably a killer. Four fuses, I saw them all, right? There was like one here. I guess coming in this room beforehand was um, oddly good for me in that case, because I saw these things. Number two, it sounds so loud, like a drum being kicked almost. We don't want to check this either. Got to get those lights on first, he says. He wants to see all of them surroundings. Number three, number four, I think, where was it, dude? I don't remember the fourth one. Now this one, ain't it? Come on, fourth fuse. Let's just flip it. Let's go. It's got to be around here, man. Got to be close by. Here it is. This is it. And the light's turned on. The person from earlier must have left. I'll confirm it with the surveillance room on this floor. Okay, you know best, so you know best. Usual steps. That's fine. So the, it's like the fire alarms. They are all fine, but my sanity or my life may not be fine very, very soon. Because that's the problem here. Now, I didn't even see this room. Like this one here. It's like the uh, the room where we can check on the surveillance. Before we do that, let me just um, turn these lights in the bathrooms and lock up the other door. Wait. What the freak is going on, dude? Hang on. There's no door. There's just, there's nothing there. Okay, this place is weird. This, it's, there's something wrong here, man. There's something wrong. If the fourth floor didn't tell us that alone, now the fifth floor has reminded us like, yes, this is a messed up building. You should probably go home. What's the dark history of this place? Like, what happened here? You know, what happened? I'm gonna, I'm gonna check you out real soon, man. Let's see what's on these cameras. First of all, 
Oh, this is pretty cool. So we can check the feeds. Floor 1F, that's where we started out. Two, number three, four, five. This is the floor we're on. Wait, your boyfriend is a security guard, right? Oh, yeah. He's pretty good looking, so I made him mine. <laughs> but wasn't he dating her before? Yeah, everyone knows that. Well, except for that power. So basically, you took them by force. Um, that's a terrible t way to say it. I'm going to read this quick. Well, basically, I won't... I won him over by... So Seriously? It's quick, guys. Anyway, she was no match for me. I'm more charming, and it was inevitable. Don't you think? You're a real devil. Women are more popular than they are. Like Devilish! What happened? Oh, they're running. In the dark? Oh, they're, they're gone, man. They're in 90 degrees shot. Oh, 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 he's dead, dead. He's dead. Ma'am, leave him. She left him! Bro, she left him like that! Oh, she's going. 3F? How is she opening locked up doors? They're running away from the darkness. Oh, she got out. So she's okay? Three. Wait, what? Wait, wait, wait. That's- I'm in that room. I'm in that room! I'm in that room. Bro, we gotta go. I'm in that room, guys. I'm in that room. Yeah, how about I watch some, uh, some BCI good stuff real quick, you know? <laughs> Help me. She's gonna wait behind us. She'll be- she'll get bored. My strap will pay off. This is like telling us some kind of story I think about maybe the victim? <laughs> really lucky. Thanks to everyone early. Name was censored. She takes responsibility for everything. What if she quits? Wow, that would be troublesome. If she does, I might end up resenting her. Wow, okay. Just for not wanting to work there? Man, they sound so happy. All right. I got a feeling this is all relating to that lady. We keep seeing, and she's probably out there, right? Let me just check that cam five. Like, maybe she got bored and left, you know, guys? She did. Like, it's fine. It's all good. It's happy. I think. Oh, yeah. It's happy. It's happy. Please just remain happy. Please remain happy. It's it's remaining happy. Floor five is done. Floor five is done. And, uh, only, uh, onwards and upwards, right, guys? That's what they say. Onwards and upwards, or something like that. I'm standing this far, but... Was that, like, glowing eyes? Or was that the vending machine simply just glowing at the perfect angle? This is how my brain is now starting to, like, conjure up everything that I see. It doesn't understand. It's making the worst case of... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna need SWAT teams, I think. Can you turn around slowly, please, ma'am? Please? Uh, yo. She's not real. I, I am her for some reason. This is a very interesting experience. What's going on? She's like frozen in time. What? But why? What the heck is... Okay, what is with this floor? Um, is there a past tragedy that went down? Are we seeing like a flashback almost? <gasps> Hold up. Someone got busy with the knife, I think. Was it you? Was it you? Let's see what's happening in here. This is weird, man. This is very weird. Uh, we've got vending machines everywhere. And these chairs stacked up with blood in between them. I don't understand that. Just do our job, right, guys? We do our job. Wait, there's a camera here. No, I want that music. Keep it playing. Yes, yeah, smooth jams. No abnormality. But have you not checked out the whole room here, bud? Do you not think that's a bit of an abnormality? The way this whole thing is laid out? Is that not slightly concerning to you, sir? Like, just a little bit. Because it is me, just a little bit. My alarm is like, it is going off, guys. And I didn't name that alarm, run home as fast as you can. So, like, we should probably just follow the alarm. Being here, present, in this very place, in this very uh, office, in this very office block, is gonna do you way more harm than it ever will good. She's just chilling like that. Oh, oh. hey, ma'am, how you doing? Don't, don't blame me. Oh, that's actually... That makes me feel really uncomfortable. Bro, she's freaking me out. What the freak is going on? Dude, I don't want to do this. Oh my god. Bro, why... Why is she doing that? Hello? Oh, I can be here again. Alright, see the door at this angle? That's all good.
let's just pretend that floor didn't happen, okay, guys? Just, uh, keep doing our job, you know? I'm dead. I'm gonna die. I'm not gonna die. Wait. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Now, do I go at this floor? Whoa, whoa, whoa. The switch is missing. It might be nearby. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and look for it. You don't want to just hit the exposed circuit board and just pray. How about we just do floor eight, you know, bud? Let's go floor eight. Oh, what have I done? I've called the same floor. I closed the door. I've now opened the door again. I'm feeling like we take it back down to floor 1F. I might take a little, uh, little side trip, you know, get some, uh, get some weapons, a couple of handguns, you know, a couple of magazines and come back here because this ain't it. That's it. That's police tape. It's police tape, man. Something. How is he doing that? that it just, it doesn't look comfortable. I, I wouldn't do that if I were you. It's weird. Hey, okay. this is... Whole floor is strange, bro. No, 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 don't climb it yet. What is with that guy in that room? Why is he looking like that? Do you have blood around his face? Dude, I don't know. I have no idea. Can we enter? We can, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> what the freak, bro? Oh my God. I, Dude, I am so scared. His eyes are following me though. No, I'm, I'm burning these dolls up, man. What is this? An advent calendar dedicated to it? Oh my god, this is terrifying. Why didn't the, I don't know why I didn't expect this. In the bathroom, great. So just one urinal, where do I poop, huh? I'm looking for the buttons, right? I, I gotta, I'm gonna climb this one without the weird mannequin. I don't think it, it's not good, bro. Oh, it was good. It was good, it was worth it. It was worth it, okay. Wait, don't go down yet. Let's just check a little bit more. Doesn't look like it, but you see, bro, the ceiling is like collapsing down. I think it's that fabric that they use to insulate the building. Maybe shielding some noise, heat, you know, all those kind of things. This building is uh, it's crumbling at the very foundation. Where do I exit? There it is. I was getting so confused right there. But what's with these guys? Yeah, I see you. Is there someone in there? I'm, I'm trying to see if there's breathing or something. Okay, listen, bud. Let's just join him there. He's going to grab my feet. I'm actually worried about this one. Oh, boy. Yeah, yeah, that's it. That Hey, sir, how you doing? How you doing, huh? How you doing? You like this? You like this? I'm gonna climb down. What is the significance with this thing? This bizarre looking doll. It's alive in some capacity. There's something about it which is sentient and I don't understand why. Next room. Dude, that's louder. What was that? Another one? What makes that sound is what I, I'm, okay, I'm a little bit confused. It's like it climbed a ladder. Oh, okay. All right. Let me just take that. Side. Let me just. Don't, don't do it. 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 Okay, climb down. What? Okay, what is with this doll? There's some significance, some weird significance. Look around slowly, cause it might be there, ready to break your neck. And okay, the scene is the same. Do I go this way? I found three so far. Oh my goodness me. Oh my goodness. Okay, there's nothing there. This has to be the fourth one. It's got to be up here, right? It, it, it should be. Theoretically, you'd expect to find it here. Okay, let's go, let's go. It's right there. Yep, it's right there. We did our thing, we did our thing. Climb down, four buttons. The objective is done. The objective is done. Slowly does it. Bro, this is really scary. We heard footsteps. Let me just check, you're still there. I gotta assume your buddy's there too. Just gonna go on a whim. I didn't do any fire inspections. Don't actually care about this floor. I think the fire's already done the damage. <laughs> Look at them, just stare at them. Yeah, what's going on, sir? What's going on? What are they? Why? Like, why would they be here? There's some weird significance here, I think. We don't want to comment on them. You know what I do want to comment on, though? Me leaving for floor number eight. So great. Oh my god, this game is actually getting me a lot. It's done really well. It's like, I'm now nervous to go to the next floor because it's getting more and more creepy every time. Oh, man. Okay, it looks a bit cleaner. How about we just stay... Keep our head strong. Head strong. Head strong. No, I ain't playing kick the cat. Okay, hang on. Guys, I want to make jokes. I want to try and entertain you. But I am feeling so much bowel movement that I'm actually thinking like, do I get away from my computer and legitimately sit on that toilet for a couple of minutes, pass that movement, so the next time I jump, I don't pass it in front of the camera. Just do my job. Do my job. I check these, uh... These things, I think the fire again is like damage this floor, man. It's so dark as well, I can't see anyone. I don't see any life here. Yep, great, great, no abnormalities. Other than the uh, 100,000 other ones we've seen, I don't see any people. It's like they left already, right? Someone left, like the camera rolled out. 
Something like that, guys. I don't know. Bathroom one? I, I'm so worried about one of these stalls kicking open real soon, man. Or the fact that you have to look down at those lights to uh, turn them off. It's prime, man. You click that light, you turn around, something is there in the doorway. <laughs> it's not my fault that I couldn't do anything because they died. Everyone disappeared because of them. I didn't do anything wrong. Everything is their fault. Hey, ma'am, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to help me out here, dude. I don't know. I can't open the door. I I, I don't want to move, bro. I don't want to move. Oh! There's nothing in there. Okay, we got some more bags. This place is just. It's bad. Talking about death, couldn't help them. All that stuff. She sounded a bit sad though. Maybe that is about the same character we've seen many times before. In relation to her, I don't know. Get this door closed up as well. All right, the familiar jingle. 8F, despite being pretty horrific and having some uh, weird, at least, backstory here, wasn't as bad as those other floors. Especially that seventh floor. That was a very weird one. We got nine, 10, and then 11, and we're all done for our job for the day. Man, the wife is not gonna believe this story. She's not gonna believe this story. This is gonna have to just stay in my head rent-free. If I speak this out loud, I think I'll get sent to the, like, the police, bro. They're gonna be like, yeah, we need to, uh, get you some more medication, dude. Grimy walls, like, talking mannequins? What are you talking about, man? What are you talking about? We got nine of here. It's a darkened floor. What? What was that? Huh? Dude, I wanna... There's something very wrong on this floor. I feel like I wanna be quiet. It's, it's like when I talk, I miss something. Let's go, let's go. Okay, two scariest rooms done. Great. That's good. Don't worry about it. Let's go bounce in these rooms. We haven't seen- uh -oh. oh! Well, we found someone. Hey, your neck look broke, sir. Eyes wide open. Oh, he's good! He was just- He was just sleeping, guys. Yep. Uh, yeah? Crap! I fell asleep! It's already this late? What's up with you? You keep coming over and over again. You're standing there every time I wake up. Were you here the whole time? Whatever. Do you know where my boss is? Did he leave already? That dang power harasser said he wouldn't leave until everyone else did. I'm leaving too. Yep, you really should, bud. You really should get out of here. Goodbye, sir. All right, good stuff. What should have been a normal day at work has soon turned into this extremely tragic place. For real, man. Messed up. Yep, goodbye, man. Goodbye, stay safe and get home in one piece, please. What's that sound? Is that a, is that a ghost like fun? Uh, Bro, I don't want I don't want to do it. This game is doing tension really well, man. Nope, nope, you know what? That ain't abnormal. That is. That's a little bit abnormal. I'm just saying, like, you lose momentum and then pick it back up. You know what, man? You have fun on that chair. You enjoy your... But why did that door close on my face? I hate that. I hate that. I'm gonna lock the door. I'm gonna lock the door. Why would I examine the spinny chair? Why would I scare myself when I'm literally dealing with paranormal elements? I'm out. I'm out, bro. I'm out. I should have locked these doors and ran. Locked the ghost in there, even though ghosts can go through walls. I've locked no one in there. The ghost is behind me. Wait. It's doing it well, and I'm out. Floor nine was a weird one. Very strange, just a bit. Looks like the switches on this floor don't work. You're gonna use the emergency exit? I can't believe you've done this. Guys, I'm just saying like, help me, you know? Just help me, just a little bit. Oh, we didn't go down. Bro, do I do it? Hold up. <sighs> Curiosity killed that cat, man. Oh no, you know what? This cat's living today. I wonder if we check this door and it doesn't work. That's what I wanna do. Hold up. It's locked. I figured. Now we go down here. Okay, we were going this way no matter what happened. This was our set path by choice. And it's a windy one indeed. We ain't seen ma'am again. We have not seen her again. Is there any way we can help her? Maybe that's the way we get a better ending. I believe this game does have two different endings. What is that? Huh? Hello? What the freak? I pressed it. I pressed it. There was no comments. Dude, what is that beeping? I feel like it's gonna kill me. I don't know. Huh? Push it again. Wait, wait, we're stuck in a loop, right? Look at this. This is weird. Press, 
There's a key. You obtain. <laughs> Bro, I was ready to start swinging. I was ready to start swinging, man. I was gonna do one of these. Ain't this ambience just swell, man? Ain't this ambience just swell? Cause, uh. Hey, man. Listen. How do I prove I want to help you? You do not need to kill me! He heed me. Hear me, hear me. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, that was kind of cool. Dang, why does she... Why does she back up like that? It's like she was gonna kill us, but then maybe she realized we weren't someone who tormented her in the past. And so she let us live. That is very interesting. That is very interesting. Okay, you know what? See you guys, I'm going home. It's an invisible wall, guys. I ain't going home. I'm going up and out. Maybe that's what we gained from here so far. She didn't attack us outright, did she? She actually left us. Maybe that's for a reason. Maybe if we just at least acknowledge that for now. Maybe that will bring something our way. All right, bro. What the heck, bro? What the heck, bro? I, I didn't just sleep well last night, man. It's these night shifts. Yeah, no abnormality. I'm just going to add that text again at the bottom whilst we just slowly pan across this room, guys. No abnormality, by the way. There's nothing wrong here. I love this guy's just enthusiasm for this situation. I love it. Like, no abnormalities? What are you talking about? There's nothing wrong with any of this. There never has been. What are you talking about, abnormality? You're the abnormality for thinking this is wrong. This is normal. That isn't. Gotta clean that board up. That's the only thing. Uh, yeah, again, I'm just gonna... Oh, it's on screen again. There's nothing wrong here, guys. It's normal. I'm glad no one's like... Sticking behind in this office space, I would have questions how they're working, right? Upside down, how are they getting that? How are they getting that? Toilets upside down? Oh, thank gosh I don't gotta poop upside down. Can you imagine that? Don't imagine that, guys. It would not be a good thought to imagine. Light goes off. All right, easy money. Literally easiest money. And we close this. Great. Great. So, it's the last floor, man. It's the last floor. Please don't tell me she's in there. I'm worried. Can this hurry up? It's the cleanest thing in this whole floor, man. Now, we've seen how this place is decaying the further up we get. So what's gonna happen on the highest floor? Floor 1-1. One, one. The final... Whoa, what should be the final floor? Hey! Okay, this don't feel like... This isn't going up, is it? It's going down. It's like Silent Hill, almost. We're being like... Rip down into this other world because of her emotions. Whoa! Hey, hey! It ain't my fault. I don't want to get messy. What's this? What can I do? How do I please? How do I please you? Okay, the bugs don't work. No, 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 no. Wait. Whoa! Look at this. The writing on the walls like that. Is that a computer? A lone computer. What floor are we even on right now, guys? What it- Is that her face in the monitor? Is that us? Okay, that's kind of weird though, man. What the frick, bro? Click it? Huh? Walking backwards away from us. Wait, what is this? She's gone. I'm still- I'm locked into stair- oh! 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 Do we have a choice? Do we have a choice here? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Let me just see if we go back here. Can we press a button and leave this place for good? Dude, we're locked in. We're not leaving. We're not leaving. The only way we're leaving is going down this floor. I wonder if this is the floor where the accident went down for this uh, lady. Was she like overworked to death? I don't know. It's like there's so much text on the wall at times. It just turns into a complete red solid color. Listen, you know I'm just a night guard, right? You know, night security, I look after this place. I'm just trying to help you out, man. I hope I hope you know that I'm not trying to harm you. Are you trying to harm me? You just, we just played a game, you know, we're just playing like funny games and funny, you know. Uh, you're not trying to kill me, you know. I think she's trying to kill me. Go in these rooms, bro, it's dark. There's a monitor in the middle and some kind of padlock. Hang on, there's a VCR here, no cable. Nothing is displaying, and we've got this here. We need some kind of combination, so we're gonna have to figure this one out. We can spin all those two independently. Okay, let's uh, let's look around. Wait, what have I done? Okay, second room has got chalkboards. Let me just exit for one moment here. 
Um, I assume this door's gonna be locked up. It's yeah, it's gotta be, man. It's a bloody mess. This whole floor. This whole floor is messed up. I can't even see the time. Oh, I can. Obtain the blood stain lid. I think I should be able to clean the stain. Bathroom. We're going to the bathroom, cleaning that lid, and then maybe we're gonna see a time. Do we really have to inspect these bar? Like, okay, good. We are thinking a little bit more sensibly now. I was worried this dude was gonna be like, oh, no, 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 this, this is fine. I can hear. Okay. We wash the stained lid. And I wash the blood off the lid. There are two lines drawn on it. Oh, it's gonna be different times. And then we can input that most likely into the uh, the safety combination. Here we go. Nine, okay, we got 9.30. Uh, the zero's crippled over the top. Look, 90.60. Aha, I'm seeing that. That's the out one is 90, inner one is 60. Nice and easy, no problem. That blood looks very red, just there. Just a little bit there. The out one is on that 90. And the inner one should be 60. I think this might be right. Drop that there. Hey, what's going on, bro? Aha, 60, 90. So it was close. There's the videotape, but the cable is missing. How do we watch it without the cable, right? That's the next thing we gotta find. Uh, maybe it's somewhere in a drawer or something? Yep, no, I'm no man at you. Okay, where might that next thing be? I haven't seen that anywhere. Didn't come across that. Maybe it was in the bathroom? Can we actually check the stalls? Maybe in here? No, you don't wanna recycle the cable? Are oh, you guys animals? I assume he don't need that no more. Cable goes in and we, uh... Let's go ahead, get comfy, guys. You got your popcorn, you got a nice drink? Don't drink it to this, you might throw it back up. That's all I'm saying. Static. But what do we see beyond the static? Hmm. What was that sound? I have no idea. Can we do anything? Okay, we can't. We just, we have to watch. It's just a computer. Is somebody gonna like thump in front of the camera? Ugh. Wait, nothing happened though. It's just weird noises coming in. Listen for what we hear. I don't see anyone in the, uh, in the noise of this. There is talking, but I don't know guys. I don't know. This is the most like, wait, am I changing these? No, I'm not. The bathroom? In these key locations, it's pointing to us to check. The male bathroom, you know, the top right corners we go in maybe. Please tape. It's all pointing to the death of someone. Were they overworked, something like that? You know, the boss who's strict. Maybe the lady was driven to death to escape this work. Just having to work, work, work. All points to it. The lady who we saw- I, the I love. It was her, we saw her before. Oh, you only just figured that. Let's get out of here. But can we help this person before we leave? Can we help this person? You can't be helped in there, you're staying in there. Oh, oh, oh. Bro, what the freak? I ran away. Die once? Bro, what the freak? Okay, that got me. Wow. All right, we gotta run. Right, here's my plan. Here we go, we go. Let's go, ma'am. Let's go. She's pretty slow. She's pretty slow, but she's very scary. Man, check that out. All right, I'm going. I'm going. Oh, she gates that. There's like, there's a monitor back there. Hang on, hang on, hang on. There's something we can do here. Oh, yeah, she's creepy. Very creepy. Let's go. Bounce, 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 bounce like a basketball bounce. All the way down here. Hit this monitor, see if we can change something. Here we go. There's a drawing on the wall. What is this? What is this? Tell, what is this? Tell me. My child's birthday. 23. Is that right? Why don't you, why it right, ma'am? 23. What was the month? What was the month? There was a month too. I think that's what we got to figure out here. If we input this, maybe we can survive. Was it October? Bro, I'm dead. I want to figure this. I feel like if we do this, we can get the good ending. It was the 23rd of something. What was the month? Was it December? Because it's like I can easily escape her if I leave. Like, I could just open that door and run. But I feel... I got to do this. I got to do this. You're in my way. I must do this. Let's go. Okay, that was a fun jingle. So, what is this saying? Because that was our daughter's birthday, right? That's I guess we're using that as like our driving force to get home. Let's go. Let's go. Floor one, I leave. Goodbye, ma'am. I'm sorry I couldn't help you. 
I don't know, is that even the good ending? Like what, I don't know what would have happened had if we walked all the way down. I don't know. I feel like this is like the survive ending. Get ending two. Oh, we're in like a hospital bed, look at this. Oh, did we maybe pass out as we descended from floor 11? I don't know. Hey doc, can I get a hand please? There's someone coming through, maybe my family? Some there is two feet. My daughter, hey, hey, and my wife, how are you doing? Oh my gosh, hold up. They look happy. Yes, I'm awake, hi. Um, yeah, lovely weather. No, I'm lying, there's trash out there, isn't it? It's bad weather, man, you know? <laughs> sorry, sorry about the birthday, I mean, surprise! I'm not dead! Hey, hold up. Ending to, but why am I to blame? Why? Hey, yo, why am I to blame though? Why'd she take it out on me? Why was that my fault? Like, it's like I got blamed for that. Wow. There's our full game though. That is our full game of night security. You know, I really liked that one. I feel like that was probably one of the best games I've played from them just because it was so different again. Another thing I have to give big props to, there was no glitches in this one from the release. It was very, very polished. I feel like visually as well and the presentedness of this game as well, it was perfect to what Chilla Art does absolutely best. Like tension, a interesting idea for a game. Like we've seen stuff like this before. This was expanded on so much more and there is a little bit of a story here going on. Maybe it's about that lady being overworked, you know, people throwing all their work onto her all the time. We had narratives of a boss with in this place always working so much and stuff like that so maybe that's what the case was for that one and if so very tragic and unfortunate for her but i guess we got to live to see another day and she followed me for some reason the lady on floor number four it's pretty sick in this one as well if you click continue look you can check any floor so throw me back in let's go for the other ending i guess okay now we're gonna go for this second ending then so it would be i assume leaving here yep figured and then we go down the stairs did she make us trip and fall? Man, she made us fall far enough. That sounded like uh, a little bit of the inner fluids became the outer fluids. Oh, yeah. Are these VHS tapes down the bottom? I, I assume so. Hmm. What the heck? What does that even mean, though? That's probably going to be a bad ending, I assume, because it's still continuing. This must be like an ending cutscene. Right, bro, I don't know. And that... I would assume that's another ending. It says press any button to skip. That one is interesting. It didn't really give us an ending, but it is rolling the credits. So I guess like it is, I guess an official ending. There's no achievement for this one. And it's probably gonna rewind the whole way. It certainly looks like it. It's like they played the whole game for this outro scene. Look at this, what's this? Even back to the beginning. Yeah, ending number one. Getting back into our car and driving home. Oh, it's like they make you see the whole thing. The whole way we came through, man. I'm starting to think. Oh, hold on. I'll save my thoughts. He's exiting the car. All right. Look at this noise, bro. My hands are off. My hands are off. What is this all about? Like, what the freak is this part all about, man? Is this ending one? Either way. Okay, that's so interesting and very peculiar. The only other way I can really see this game going is maybe like there was a lot of kind of pushiness with like that girl. It was like, oh, you can take my number anytime. Maybe we were almost like talking to this girl at some point, the red dress lady and our wife. Maybe we went with our wife versus that lady instead. Um, and emotionally it got to her. Maybe we were like talking to her all the time. I don't know, man. Maybe our wife was the one that escaped that scene from the, the part where we saw the elevator thing. It was like one person, they, they fell down and got slaughtered by the looks of things. I don't know. That could be the other narrative. Maybe that ghost is haunting us like, you know, this lady is, she wanted to be with us. She might even be a stalker, you know, who just got a bit too obsessed and ended her own life or something like that. And the night security was just, I was having a bad trip of that. But there was also notes about the last night security guy clearing out without even doing his shift, which relates more to that place specifically having that being within it. It could be a mixture of even both of what I said, like maybe what I said just then about that lady stalking us, being obsessed with us is the case. And maybe she lost her life within that building, which we now got our job in, which is now why we're experiencing this again. I don't know, I have no idea. Either way, really enjoyed this one from Chiller's Art. I like the pacing. This was a shorter game compared to the other stuff, but what I will say is that it packed a punch 
punch, and the pacing of this game felt way better than some of the other stuff. It wasn't just like, you know, two hours for the sake of being two hours. This was a game that for every second of the content, it was doing something and always carrying the story with it. So way better with this one. Visually, I really enjoyed this one as an experience, and I really enjoyed this one as a whole. This was a great little adventure from Chilazat. So big props to those guys. Your games are improving. This is a really good one. If you guys do want to play it, night security for yourself, you can check that link down below. But for this video right here, that's going to be everything. And I really hope you did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like rate? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thanks so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, I hope you did enjoy. Yeah, man, I'm sticking to the day shift only.